Michigan State and Penn State. This was a really fun game, game to watch because of the snow. Obviously, Penn State's uniforms, a field that is completely covered in white powder, was awesome. Michigan State's postgame win expectancy was 78% here. Uh, you look at some of the numbers, it, it, it'll make you go crazy looking at some of it. I, I would not have expected 451 yards of total offense for Michigan State against that Penn State defense. And the majority of it, well, not the majority. Let me take that back. 183 yards rushing in this game for Michigan State. Uh, people have not been able to do that on Penn State. Like it's you, you wouldn't expect it really. Penn State did have two turnovers. Michigan State had one. This was just strange. And of course, Penn State could not run the football. Only had sixty-one yards rushing on twenty-six attempts. That's two point three per. Michigan State only three point nine per rush. But Kenneth Walker thirty carries, one hundred thirty-eight yards. Got uh, got back into the way that it was supposed to go. So really straight. Go ahead. Go ahead. Give me your thoughts. No, this is exactly what Michigan State's done all year outside of against uh, Ohio State. They they run the ball. They stop the run. And there's nothing you can do about it. That They win these games from the trenches. If you can't throw on them because their biggest weaknesses are secondary and Penn State can't throw on anybody, then they're going to beat you up physically. Yes. And you're going to have a hard time to win that game. I, I, I thought Michigan State was a better team going in here because the one thing they do bad, Penn State can't pick apart. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.